It may just be any Saturday morning hockey game for some kids, but 10-year-old Taylor Clark is living a dream just being on the ice. How much fun and good. It means the world. It's, um, he's always wanted to be on a hockey team since he was a little boy, and this has just been a dream come true for him. Taylor is part of the new special needs hockey program run by the city of Kamloops, and it's exactly what he needed. Playing hockey on the ice or on the street has been a struggle for Taylor, with kids not wanting to include him in games. But this program is allowing Taylor and other kids with developmental challenges to break barriers and be part of a hockey team. This has been really good. He's made a lot of new friends. He goes Thursday nights playing floor hockey with them. The coaches have just been awesome and it's just been a, he's become more independent and he just loves it. It's only the second year of the program, taking a giant leap forward from last year when the focus was on the basics of skating and handling the puck. Twelve months later, they're into full-on scrimmages and playing teams around the southern interior. Actually, last year we had uh, the Kelowna team come to us and ask if we wanted to be a part of the league. So there's about four teams in the Okanagan that play. Uh, City of Kamloops and Parks and Rec got behind it right away. Uh, the Blazers were huge in support and, and a lot of the sponsors around town. So uh, to see it come to this with exhibition games and getting ice here at ISC, it's just, it's, uh, it's cherry on top. It's great. The kids get to scrimmage at least once a week, and every time they step on the ice, it's an opportunity to let loose and be one of their hockey heroes. Number four, I'm wearing number four today, so it's nice to wear a good jersey and know that another famous hockey player wore number four. And who's that? Bobby Orr. As for Taylor, like any 10-year-old boy, he still has aspirations to go far in hockey and play for the hometown team. He's grown up watching the Blazers, so that's his dream is to be a Kamloops Blazer one day, so we'll wait and see.